dipole in a uniform electric field. Consider a polar molecule. Polar means the center of positive charges and negative charges are separated by a distance. For example, a water molecule. Here this is a water molecule. This is the O minus ions. This is 2 H plus ions. Here the center of mass of this H plus ion. This is the this one. 1 H plus another, another H plus. The center of mass will be this point. And the center of mass of the negative charge will be this one. And hence this center of mass of the negative charges. Center of mass of the positive charges are separated by a distance. And hence a dipole will be formed. And this dipole moment will be in this direction. Then from negative to the positive direction. And consider such a molecule in an electric field. That is a dipole means two equal and opposite charges separated by a distance. This forms a dipole, electric dipole. When this dipole is placed in an electric field. So we are considering a dipole. The distance d. So this dipole is placed in an electric field. This is an electric field applied. The direction of the field is this one. So this one is positive and this is negative. From positive to negative the direction of the electric field. Hence this dipole has two equal charges plus q and a minus q and this plus q will be shifted to or it experiences a force along this direction that is it experiences a force along this direction because of this field the force experienced is this charge into the electric field q a and this minus q it will experience a force in this direction because this is the positive charge so this is the direction So, because of in the presence of a electric field, a dipole will experience forces and this uh, positive charge side or plus Q of this dipole, it experiences a force along the negative side of this electric field or in this direction and the minus charge it will experience along this direction. As a result, there, is, there exist two forces and the resultant of this force. And the resultant force will be or the net force is 0 that is QA minus QA it will be 0. So here the net force will be 0. Here the field is uniform so the force on the positive charge and the force on the negative charge will cancel each other and hence the net force will be 0. But since the force is zero, we can calculate the torque. There should be some torque. Since the force is zero, there should be some torque. And the torque can be represented as this tau is equal to, or we can represent the torque as N. This torque can be represented as the product of force, one of the forces into the perpendicular distance between the forces. One of the force is QE, the magnitude of the force is QE into the perpendicular distance means suppose this dipole is making an angle theta with this field. Then we can consider this perpendicular distance as this will be the perpendicular distance. This is the perpendicular distance between this plus charge and minus charge. That is or we can say the perpendicular distance between the plus QE and minus QE perpendicular distance between the two forces so this side it will gives with respect to this theta it will gives the opposite side and this is d the distance between the positive charge and negative charge so this uh, per force perpendicular distance will gives d sin theta so it can be represented as q e d sin theta but we know that the q into d it is the dipole moment electric dipole moment hence we can represent it as e into dipole moment e into p sin theta 
or it can be represented as the torque acting on this dipole can be represented as P cross E. P cross E. P cross E. Hence, we can consider, we can say that under the action of a torque, a dipole will be aligned parallel to this applied field. So, under the action of a force, the dipole will be aligned. So, under the action of a torque, the dipole will be aligned this parallel to this field because under the action of this a torque, that is a set of equal and opposite forces which are uh, parallel forces. So, this dipole will uh, set, into, set into oscillation and it will be aligned parallel to this field.